Hello Sagittarius, this is your monthly reading for November. This reading is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. We're just going to jump right into this. I am tired, you guys. Let's see, what is the energy around my Sagittarius? What's the energy around Sagittarius? Please show me the energy around Sagittarius. Nine of Cups. Hmm, feeling flirty, are we? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, ener okay, energy. Oh, okay, Four of Wands there. Some of you guys are asking someone to marry you, asking someone to move in. Um, I'm feeling like there's this happy feeling coming from you guys here. Aries energy is there. There's a proposal here or there is um, a, a proposition like to date or something going on here. Um, if you guys are happy, why are you freaking here? I'm just kidding. But yeah, I'm feeling some good energy coming from this. Okay. Somebody that you are like smitten with or somebody is smitten with you. What is the underlying issue here, if there is one? Underlying issue here. What is the underlying issue here? Eight of Wands. Forward movement. Maybe this is a situation where either you guys are interested in someone and they don't know. Or there's someone that's interested in you guys and you didn't know until now. Okay. Um, but I don't feel like there's been any forward movement in this situation is the, is the issue. Um, no chance has been taken. No words have been spoken that would propel this situation forward. This is your card here, uh, the Eight of Wands, Sagittarius energy, okay? Let's see, in the recent past. What's going on in the recent past for Sagittarius? Ooh, Three of Swords. Maybe this broken heart is not the result of this person who um, you guys are interested in. Maybe it's something else that happened before the interest in this person. But in the recent past, I feel your heart has been broken. You've been disappointed by... You have been disappointed by this person. This may be somebody that you have a history with. Or was married to before. And this person broke your heart once upon a time. But there is, I feel there's an interest being shown towards this person. But I don't think that you've made like any action towards them. It's just something that you're feeling inside. Maybe this is a feeling that's always been there for this person. Even though they hurt you. Aquarius energy there. Hmm. Crowning thoughts for Sagittarius. Crowning thoughts for Sagittarius. Crowning thoughts for Sagittarius. Judgment. Scorpio energy again. Scorpio Aries is here. Hmm. Judgment. Making a decision. Changing some shit. You guys, you know, this is a this is a um, situation that really does call for you to think about what it is that you truly want. And if it's if it's liable to happen like in reality. Because I feel that there's something else that's on the line here for you. Maybe some of you guys are already married or, or, or are already in relationships and stepping out and communicating with this other person could potentially ruin another situation that you guys are involved in. But, you know, in your head, is you, you know you have to decide, you have to make a decision on what it is that you're going to do and what action you actually are going to take. 
because there's somebody here that you feel like um, you guys can be good together, you can be happy together, you can grow together, but um, there's something that, that's happened in the recent past. I feel that, you know, you're just not so sure of yourself in this situation. Interesting. Hmm. What's coming in for Sagittarius? What's coming in for Sagittarius? Ooh, the sun. <laughs> Happiness. I feel like guidance too. I feel like you guys are being enlightened. Like you're gonna receive this um this aha sort of moment where instantly you're gonna know exactly what to do and how to do it. You know, Leo energy here. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Scorpio energy um, is front and center. Aquarius is here as well for you guys. Aquarius and Leo are opposite signs. Could be that this Leo individual, a Leo individual, is a cause of the heartbreak. And you guys have your, your sights set on um, another fire energy, an Aries energy. I feel like this Aries person, this Aries energy or Scorpionic energy has you guys feeling like um, this feels like almost like a love triangle, but not. I feel like you had a situation or a relationship with someone before and that person quite possibly broke your heart. They had your heart as well in order to break it. And then you guys have something else that's going on and that could potentially bring you a lot of happiness but this individual right here basically it's still where your heart is I'm feeling and so it's really getting in the way of the potential that this other situation um, can have for you positive potential this other situation can have for you but you guys know you have to make a decision one way or the other this is some juicy shit let's see how is Sagittarius viewing this situation Ace of Cups. Oh yeah, you've got mad love. You've got mad love for this person. Mad love for them. And I don't think that in your mind, in your head space, there's nobody that can fill this person's shoes for you. Nobody can do it for you like they can, is what I'm getting here. <clears throat> what is the influence here for Sagittarius? Ten of Wands. You've got a lot on your plate. That's for damn sure. You've got a lot going on. You've got a lot going on, but it's it's time to like, you know, let somebody else carry part of this burden. Whoever this is, you, you're ready to start over. You're ready to get this off of your chest, I feel. That is you, Ten of Wands. Hopes or fears for Sagittarius. <laughs> the full Aries energy. Your hope is that you guys can start over. You can start anew. Do things totally different. Okay? Forget about everybody else and just step out on faith in this thing. Wow. Overall outcome for Sagittarius. Overall outcome for Sagittarius. Six of Pentacles, getting what you want, getting what you feel like you deserve. Taurus energy there could definitely be an Aries Taurus cusper for you guys. I feel like, you know, you're going to get the time that you are actually asking for, that you're wanting. But you're going to have to make a decision one way or the other in order to move things forward. Okay, guys, so that's what I have for you, and I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye.